Well, good day, everybody. Bruce and Trudy are going to go on Rooster Shop Excellent Adventures. We're going to be going north of here to possibly five or six towns. There we go. We got our friends. Deb, Dale, Earl, Kathy, and we're all going to go on an excellent adventure, dude. Let's we'll see how it goes. <laughs> okay. Bruce's shop. It's excellent adventure for the day when we're going north to a couple of towns north of here. The guys have got an overheated van. So we will keep you posted on the day. Thanks a lot. That's how it goes, right? <laughs> Update. Bruce's shop tour. Excellent adventure. It was a radiator cap on the van. They're going to pick us up in a bit. We'll let you know. Well, it's an hour later and Earl here says it's Bruce's shop mediocre adventure. <laughs> we haven't left yet. Still waiting for our driver. <laughs> <laughs> Hot boy. Let me out! Let me out! Still waiting for our driver. How's it going back? How's it going back there with Bruce's uh, mediocre adventure? All right. So there's one of the big reuse. Does that feel better now if I turn this a bit? Do you feel it? I feel it more. You like it up? We'll be back in a few minutes when somebody gets arterial thrombosis. So the luck on there is where we buy groceries. And Mega. And all I said was, I'm so glad you picked this place. Because trust me, if I had picked it, or anybody else had picked it, we would have heard about it. So we just found out that our driver Alan picked up his license this morning. <laughs> the other guy lost his, that's why it's not So we stayed back in there. No tripod. Yeah. Uh, you understand tripod? Oh, we didn't run it. Yeah. Um, but the beach. We didn't like the problem. It was very tight. This is what's happening to Bucerias right now, folks. There's one of these things every two or three blocks. Oh, I yeah, yeah. Correcto. Crazy. That's my So now we're going up the coast to their first stop, and I have no idea what it is. Guayabatas is our first. Oh, Guayabatas is our first stop. I've been there. What's close to Guayabatas, Trudy? La Panita. La Panita. the corner might be able to see it might not be able to so that was mediocre <laughs>
That means that. Mm. Okay, here we're back. We're back on Bruce's chops. This uh, is about that matter. Adventure. Nice highway here. Shop. 
We're in a town called Guayobetos. We stayed here years ago. This part was recognizable to us. And then over here, from my point to the right, further on, like past this island, there was nothing. And now if you look, if you look down over there, there's buildings all the way as far as the eye can see. Stayed about right there. Thanks, guys. Here we are again on Brewster Shop Mediocre Adventures. It's getting more less mediocre all the time. It's beautiful. Low DeMarcos. Low DeMarcos. Thank you, Trudy. You know what? I remember this more so that mountain there. Hola amigos. Hola. ¿Cómo está? Muy bien, ¿es tú? Muy bien. Bruce's forgettable adventures. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting better all the time, folks. We could have food here. Like a six beer van. Yeah. <laughs> six beer van. <laughs> Here we are in San Francisco, north of Bucerias, north of Puerto Vallarta, on Bruce's shop, Mediocre Tours. Okay, the tour continues. We are in Salialita. It's a, there's quite a bit of surfing here. We'll get over there in a second. And okay, let's see if we can get somebody up here. I know I got some wind noise, guys, sorry. We're getting closer to population now. There's just more and more people, right? They're getting set up. Starting to turn. There goes one. Perfect. Here goes some more. Look at that, man. Look at that. That was a good one. Right on, you guys. That was good. Let's just do a small pan now. It's a beautiful little spot. Well done town. Everything's clean. Oops. 
This is shop mediocre tours. Back here, we'll look at the amenities. Always a restaurant at the end of every street, right there. Thank you, guys. Hello, my friends. Where's here? Well, we're gonna we're gonna just take a, a little map tour of uh, our van trip that we took, and I'm gonna zoom out. Whoops! I'll zoom out first and show you Mexico. So we'll just pull it down a little bit. So there's most of Mexico. Uh, most of the Easterners they like to go to Cancun and Playa del Carmen, which is over here. There we go. There's the Gulf of Mexico. There's Louisiana, Mississippi over in here, right? And uh, there's Mexico there, it's quite big. And then we'll zoom in to where we're gonna start our, our trip, which is in Puerto Vallarta. We'll start there. So there's the Bay of Banderas on the west coast of Mexico, right? And there's Puerto Vallarta. And then we're in in between Nuevo Vallarta and Bucerías, so we'll pull it up even more. And we're right beside Rio Vallarta Hotel. So there is the Rio Vallarta, but our place is a condo, so we'll go a little bit closer up. And there's our condo right there. And there's, I don't know, what, four, 30? Palapas that are made out of that nice grass. They're not, they're not regular uh, cloth umbrellas. And this is where I do most of my metal detecting right in front. I've gone next door to the hotel next door. And I've also gone, this is a blank lot. And then I've gone over to this building and done some locating uh, for metal back over in here too. So anyway, we started our trip out at the front gate right out here. Right there. All six, six of us were at the same place, so we didn't have to go pick anybody up. And we drive past, or through Bucerius, I'm sorry, on the highway. There's Bucerius there. And then we went north. Whoop, sorry. It's hard to do. And our first stop was La Panita and Recon de Guayabados. So it's actually still further up. There they are up there, right there, up this highway. There it is. It's in its own bay. So this was our first stop at La Panita. Right here. And then Recon de Guayabetas. We went into La Panita and out, and then into Recon de Guayabetas and out. Then we got back on the highway. And our next stop was uh, Los Marcos. Where is that devil? Here we go, Lo de Marcos. So we're going down the highway now from Recon into Lo de Marcos and I don't remember my wife said I've been there before uh, there used to be a beach service from the Hotel de Cameron in the town next to us we, we did this we went to this beach for recreation years and years and years ago it's a beautiful little town eh? so that is Lo de Marcos, or Los de Marcos, depending on where you're from and how you say it. And then our next stop was San Francisco or San Pancho. San Pancho Paradise, you see it says right there. And San Francisco, right there. We're moving in on it, and it's a real nice little town.
And then our next stop was Salyalita, where everybody was surfing. And I tried to get the beach, the guys surfing. Salyalita is in another bay, right? So we'll zoom out a bit. We came down the highway and then into Salyalita. And there, right there, I got pictures of those similar waves with people trying to get up on their surfboards. And we stopped and had an adult beverage here. It was really nice. There's a real nice uh, beach here. Beautiful, huh? And after Salyalita, we went to Punta Mita or Punta de Mita. It's said both ways. So we got back on the highway. And we drove down the highway. We'll zoom out a little bit so that you can actually see the point. This isn't very many miles across here. Like the scale is quite small, eh? Like a one kilometer is like that. And we find La Panita. And we'll zoom in on that. We came in on the highway and there we are. Or, I'm sorry, Punta de Mita. The hell's starting to sound the same to me. So this is Punta Mita or Punta de Mita. And we came in on the edge of town, worked our way through the town, and this is a this this is the part I remember. And I'm going to zoom in and show you something really cool. Do you see this white line here? That's like a hundred foot long tall cliff. So these condos or whatever they are are up above the cliff and then below the hundred foot cliff is the restaurants down in here. So we came along here and I don't think I got this on film because I was getting tired up to the highway and then back. You can see the highway there. Back onto the highway. Through the little town called La Cruz which I've pointed at in other videos, over to Bucerias, up the highway back into our neighborhood, to Rio Vallarta, and we're right next door to Rio Vallarta. Whoops! Isn't that cool? Thanks a lot for going along with me this one, this one, guys.